All right, welcome guys. We got a special treat for everybody. Um, Chris, you wanna tell them what's going on? Okay, so as you can see, we've got a Masters pack and we've got War of the Spark pack. Absolutely. And we have a little small treat here. It's a little for caveat. Everybody. A little caveat, everybody. Modern Masters 17th edition. But the question is, what do we do first? Exactly. So obviously two people with this camera angle, we only can open one booster box at a time. Um, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna roll this little dice and we're gonna determine if B-roll goes first or if Chris goes first. All right, you wanna do the honors, bro? Big numbers, big numbers. What'd you get? 17. All right, 17. 19. <laughs> <laughs> All what? right. So we will be opening the modern, or not modern masters, but the, what is this? What is it called again? Horizon. Zero dawn. Modern Horizon. Sorry, everybody. That shit happens sometimes. Um, we have two special guests with us today. Broly, signed by none other than the most amazing voice actor ever, along with that as well screaming cackerel on the side all right and then we also have anti-venom with us as well broly's here for luck and moral support to be honest with you all so which we all know he does so well oh yeah let me tell you oh and uh, another guest too what we're gonna hope to pull from war of the spark hopefully we'll get the foil version of liliana so she's here for moral support anyway all right, now without further ado, woo! I gotta grab the lucky knife though. All right. And lucky knife. knife, lucky knife. Looking for the lucky knife, gonna go and take a life. I mean, probably whoa, not. Whoa, whoa, whoa! We don't need take that. the life of this box. Hello. All right. Bootstraps, welcome. Bootstraps. Welcome. Here we go, everybody. That didn't cut as nearly as good as I thought it was going to. Yeah. I want you guys to see in my face. I'm gonna come find me. Ooh, look at the artwork, man. Look at how awesome that yeah. looks. Yeah. Just take a look at that. It's locked. Look how amazing that is. I mean, that is just incredible. That's a that's a wallpaper right that's there. Fantastic. I'd love that on my wall. Sorry, everybody. Cord malfunctions. You know how it is. Recorder's life. All right. And by the way, I will say this. I love the way this booster box opens. Love it. Absolutely love it. Just slides out. And I don't know about you guys, but I totally unfold the little coverings, especially the ones that come on the fat packs. Yes, I still buy fat packs. But I also hang these on my wall. But these are really nice because not only is the artwork on the front nice, they give you a nice little bonus wallpaper piece. And I think it's pretty sweet, if you ask me. Actually, yeah, yeah. All right. And then the display, of course. I love that. The display of this box is awesome. You get the gold right in front. Looks like a stairway to heaven, people. Stairway to heaven. I love the way these packs feel. Guys, look at them. It's like you're about to get a Willy Wonka's chocolate bar, but filled with it. Oh, it has all the golden tickets. So, what I'm gonna do is, I guess I'm just gonna push this guy back. And we'll just knock these out one by one. I'm probably gonna let Chris open a few of these guys or maybe not shaking his head. Anyway, that's a good thumbnail. All right, anyway, here we go. We'll just knock them out one by one. All right, so Brandon, what are we hoping for as we're opening this? So, do you have any idea? Um, I do know a few of the money cards um 
I'm definitely hoping for. A, is it Ren and Six that's yes, in this one? Yes, Ren and Six. That is the, a four Ren and Six would be absolutely just that, killer. That'd be a fantastic pool. That's what I'm hoping for, honestly. And um, you know, let me set trash aside. I guess probably need a trash can somewhere. But really, what I'm looking for. Um, Ren and Six for sure. A foil Ren and Six. I'm a foil collector now, apparently. Um, yeah. A few other guys. Alright, we got the trash can. Okay. So, without further ado, let me adjust this camera. Got it here. Alright. I also like foil tokens. I think those are a really cool addition, and I love the foil art. Or not foil art the art series that they're releasing I think it's really cool and I am trying to get all 54 of them I don't know if these will be worth anything or not but it'll make a pretty cool play table so you guys can stop looking at this all day so keep those guys up there always looking to the future all right and the reveal so if I remember the when you open these the rare card is directly behind the mana so there it is nether spirit i'm not really too sure what he's worth or if he has anything going on um but let's see it says at the beginning of your upkeep if neither spirit is the only creature card in your graveyard you may return him to the spirit so that's pretty cool i mean that's all right not my favorite card not what i want but look at these guys or girls that's kind of risky hmm Throws of Chaos. Yeah, it looks like a chaotic throw. <laughs> Jesus. All right. We got Exclude. Conifer Worm, I guess. I don't really care for the worms. Worms always look big. They cost a lot. They have decent power toughness, but I don't really like the worms. Those are on common slots. We're going to check the value of this Nether Spirit real quick just see what it's going on. I want to keep this video current. All right, a couple of these guys, Pondering Mage. Wow, really? So apparently Nether Spirit is selling for $25? Is that what we just read? That can't be right. Arcade Mass. These, these all have this special size. Oh, okay. Well, that's fine. We can check the values later for sure. And um, I don't know if you guys like to see the commons or not. If you want to, you can leave a comment below and let me know what you feel. Um, but about the commons, speaking of which, I do like the introduction of ninjas. I don't know if this has been done before. Um, I started playing around Origins, so I'm still trying to learn about all the previous sets. But I do like the introduction of ninjas. So... All my commons will go over here so it doesn't crowd my screen. All right. Next pack. So that first pack took quite a while to open. Let's see if we can do this one a lot faster. Anybody else feel like these packs are a little harder to open than the normal ones? I do. Jesus. Opening the All right. Here we go. Zombie token. Uh, where the heck? There we go. 40 cents. Okay, so Nether Spirit is a whopping 40 cents, which is sort of what I expected, but whatever. Again, I love these cards. This is awesome. Cool. And the ninjas. And the ninjas, of course. All right, everybody, here we go. Unsettled Mariner. Interesting. I believe that's a Mariner. Mariner. Oh. Well... I faked my way through high school, so I didn't learn vocabulary. Three dollars eighty-two cents. All right, so we're we're doing okay. Not not amazing, but we're all right. So the talisman, the forgotten cave, and the sling gang lieutenant. That's me. <laughs> I'm that guy. I'm Uncle going B. home. That's how I go home. Yeah, that's how Uncle B goes home. Everybody. All right. So that's our uncommons. And then, like I said, if you guys want to see the comments, I don't know anybody that does, but leave a comment below and I'll start showing them. Because we like to talk about some comments that are just underrated. All 
Right. Soldier. Which is dope. Oh, look at that. Yeah, see, this is what I'm talking about. Oh, that's amazing. You just can't find this stuff anywhere else. I mean, that's crazy. All right, got another snow-covered mountain and... <gasps> The Morph on the Boundless. Oh shit, everybody. All right, this is the first Mythic out of the box. We're gonna hope that he's worth a couple dollars. I should know. Um, I do a lot of research, but I guess recording the video, drawing blanks over here. All right, Valiant Changeling. I do like uh, the Changelings. $13.84. All right, that's awesome. $13 Mythic. Was that my third pack? We're doing all right. We're doing okay. But the big money is going to be there. And what we're going to do is we're going to split these videos up. And we're probably going to move over towards um, War of the Spark in a separate video. So we'll be splitting these in twos. I'll open two at the end of this. And uh, Chris will open his two at the end of his video. So hopefully you guys stick along. Or if you fast forward, that's fine too. Don't mind. Hopefully this won't take a whole lot longer. These packs are just ridiculous. So when I bought these at my card shop, I was uh, told that somebody had already hit a Renin 6 and I was at Level Up Gaming and these guys went to the back and opened a brand new box, a brand new case for me just to pick my own. So my failure here is solely dependent on me and not them. Again, I like the art. It's beautiful. Yeah. All right. So snow covered plains and giver of runes or is uh, one of my favorite guy says the giver of rudy's but <laughs> we probably just got demonetized for that so there you go scale up scale up is actually a pretty good card that's worth some money there um at least last i checked it was so that was pretty cool all right commons here we go Buck 50. Scale, scale up yeah. interesting interesting well it is an uncommon so here we go. Shapeshifter. Amazing land. Oh. Love that. Ready? Spiteful, Spiteful sliver. sliver. Okay. I do like the slivers. I do like those guys. Very aggro. Love it. And um, I'm actually getting into modern to see what I, I guess what I can do. I've never played modern. Me and Chris just kind of stuck to uh, standard for such a long time. We started playing in Origins together. Chris started playing way back when cavemen were rolling around in the dirt, so, you know. Yeah, we didn't call it magic back then, we just called it living. Yeah, something like that. Ooh, grizzly bear. Foil token. Million dollar card right there, everybody. All right. Soaring. There's Chris with his chest out. Yep. Right there. Damn it. Wish I looked like that. All right. Snow covered forest. Looks good. Moment. All right. Sunbaked <laughs> Canyon. So if you guys are opening these packs, you want to look for fetches and you also want to look for shock lands because this seems to be what everybody's looking for right now. $20 card? So yeah, 20 bucks. Can't beat that. That's awesome. Uh, I'm going to put all my shocks up here next to my mythics because that's the money zone, everybody. We like the money zone. Uh, pillage, Twisted Reflection, Glacial Revelation. I had a Glacial re Revelation the other day, actually. Yeah? Yeah, it was pretty interesting. Did you get a brain freeze? I did. Guys, I'm sorry. I just I hate reaching over there. I'm trying to do this with some speed. Did I get what now? What? <laughs> All right, here we go. Elemental. Ah, see, look at that. I love that. That's a beautiful card. All right, here we go. Snow-covered island. And deep forest hermit. I think that one's actually one of the, a, a valuable rare, if I'm not mistaken. If I'm not mistaken, which I probably am because I've made a lot of mistakes. My daughter would agree. Just kidding. All right. Yeah. Deep forest hermit. Yep. So Broly's over there wishing me luck. Hopefully on this pack we're gonna pull something dirty, but it's still early. We're still early game right now. Is that in here? Beautiful light one. 
snow covered and oh foil common foil common everybody wonderful so who is behind him and we got kaya's guile i actually think that might be a pretty worthy worthy card kaya's guile maybe like a five dollar card who knows all right ravenous giant good fortune unicorn we're gonna keep this guy out because i need some good fortune all right it's common. Kyle's guy is about three bucks. Three bucks, okay. So that means everybody will buy it for like a dollar. So that's nice. Boom. All right, here we go. Illusion. Some masterful oh. artwork. Who are the artists? That's who we should be advertising. This is crazy. Mr. McKinnon, you've just outdone yourself. Look at that. That is crazy. Look at those people. They don't stand a chance. Ah. I mean, anybody that has a sun forehead, that's just not something I want to mess with. All right. Lightning Ooh. Elemental. Skelemental. Ooh, Skelemental. I like that. Lightning Skelemental. $3.50. Well, can't all be winners, so. Thanks Dude, for he's a winner in my book. Yeah, right. Watcher for tomorrow. I like that art. That's pretty Alrighty, there we go. Well, all in all, everybody, this is not doing so hot. I may say so myself. Doing awesome. And this, this also. Uh, it's a late bloomer. Yeah, right. Late bloomer. Late bloomer. Give me a fucking tumor. All right, goblin. Oh wow, that's nice. And bam. All right. I like this guy. The Collector Oomph. I like that guy. How do you even say his name? Is it Oomph or is it Weef? I don't know. <laughs> but I like him. I call him Collector Weef. Oh, here we go. Fucking chaotic throws over here. $5 card. Pretty solid. Yeah. Pretty standard card. Um, perfect. I'm right-handed, everything's on my left, so this is weird. All right, token, got this guy flying Another around. Ninja. Looks like one. All right, here we go. A Eula's Influence. Come on, everybody, what's going on? All right, forest, scale up, undead auger, okay. All right, this is the one right here. Bring it on, come on, yeah. come on. Right in six, foil right here. Oh yeah, right. or Urza, who knows? You can get somebody. But like I said, still pretty early. All right, oh, that's a nice That artwork. is a cool little piece of art. Are the artists different or are they all the same? No, I think they're all different, if I'm not mistaken. You got a, quite a few. So Mr. Almond, what is that? What is your name? Amundensen? Well, you outdid yourself, sir. Here we go. Aria of Flame. That's my daughter's name. I'm probably going to save that card. Six dollar card? Beautiful. All right. Etchings of the Chosen. Ravenous Giant. I got a Ravenous Giant. I do. My appetite. All right. Let's take some more of these guys. All right. And I'll let you guys know when we're running low on that side. Hopefully this box will buy itself with a foil Renin 6. Come on. Or a foil Urza. I'll take any foil Mythic out of this set. Alright, Zombie. Oh, I yeah, love that. Wall, uh, was that Wall Sword or something? Yep. And Force of Rage. Alright, Force of Rage, not bad. Soul Herder, Firebolt, okay. All That's right. what I call my children. What? Force of Rage. Force of Rage, call my wife Force of Will. That was about three cents. Yeah. All right, guys. Hopefully this doesn't turn into a wash here. All right. I could just get these packs open. This is crazy. 
Try to crack move on the hand feed. That would be perfect. Save our viewers some time. Elemental. Some more good artwork. I love that. All right. And Hogak. All right. Hogak. Interesting about that guy is Hogak went to modern, of course. Well, he didn't go to modern. He was made for modern. And the people that played um, abused the hell out of that guy and turned a lot of games into a two-turn win. A two-turn win. So his value at the start was ridiculous but i believe he may have gotten banned by now i'm not too sure um so i believe his value has dropped quite a bit all right foil look at that that's what i do that's my breakfast $5, not bad all right we got the bizarre trade mage you're a bizarre trade i am mage. a bizarre trade mage Jesus. Goblin Aura Flame. Let's see. Dragonscape Sliver, okay. And then a Ruination Rider. There we go. Alright. 46 now. So let's see. We got Squirrel. Woo! That's good luck. If I've ever seen it. Now that is intense looking. Yes. Very intense artwork. Here we go, Goblin Matron, foil, uncommon. Not bad, but we still have a foil rare at large. Whether that is a foil Urza or whatever, I'm just glad we got this guy too. So here we go, Force of Vigor, okay. All right, not bad, not bad. Seven dollar card. Yeah, not bad. All right. This is the one. We got the illusion. Oh, look at that guy. I love those Crazy guy. Yeah, yeah, that is a crazy looking card. Hall of Helioids Generosity. Okay. Not bad. I think that one actually might be worth a few bucks. Five dollars. Not bad, not bad. Got some more over here. That's some crazy artwork. Well done. Well done, sir. Who did that one? Noah Bradley. Awesome, bro. What? Oh, oh, oh. A foil mythic hex drinker. By itself, he's $25. All right, people. Come on now. That's what I'm talking about. Freaking Broly coming in clutch. Had the good fortune unicorn. Get out of my face. Still not the best one we could have hit, but God, he's pretty good, man. And Dead of Winter. Dead of Winter. I like that card. It's very intense looking. Um, update. Modern Horizons foil, $87. 87 bucks, everybody. Come on now. I always like Crypto Hats. Okay, anyway. That is incredible. Woo! Thank you, Broly. Thank you, C, for being here. And I don't want to forget my other guests, Venom. Of course, Liliana. Anti-Venom. Anti -venom. Sorry, man. He's, he's so mad right now. Well, um, that's awesome, everybody. You saw it here. You saw it here first. A foil mythic hex drinker. Check that out. Here we go. Beautiful art. Nice sliver. But everybody remember, we're still only two Mythics into this box. Average is about three to five. Right at six, foil, woo! That's what we're going for. We got a Tree Folk Umbra. Tree Folk, I also like saying Merfolk. And Sisse, I like saying that one too. It sounds like a slippery snake. <laughs> I like Sisse. She's a good card to see. Good card to see. All right. Guys, we are just, we are in our stride now. Not in a stride, we're in a stride. Here we go, Shapeshifter. Oh, love that. Pretty sure I was holding it upside down, but I like that. Well done, Igor. Did a fantastic job. 
All right, and hey, Echo of Eons. All it's right, mythic. it's our third mythic, everybody. Third mythic. We're doing all right. We are doing okay. That's a twelve dollar card. I'll take Almost it. Almost thirteen. I will take it. All right. Here we go. Here we go. We want we want Urza, Soren. But Ren and Six, that's who we're looking for. Don't give up. That is cool. All right. Like that, handsome gentleman. I'll never look like that. And we have... Didn't we uh, already get her? No, no. We got a different one. Queen Among Bears is different. Ah, okay, okay. All right. King of the Pride. Not bad, not bad. We're doing all right. Here we go. Take some more. All right, we're getting to the last half of this box. Probably already been past half, but we're not doing bad. I still have hope. I like the mods. Right here, Urza. Yep, we're gonna get him. All right, here we go. Ooh, foil little swamp, I'll take that. I always like these. And then crashing footfalls. Okay, not bad, not bad. Let's see what that's all about. Crashing football. $3 car. Not bad, not bad. I'm having Chris pre-break these so you guys don't have to spend a whole lot of time watching me do this. Because Lord knows. Oh, here we go. Chaotic throws on an art. Mm. They're just getting down to business. I think that girl's trying to beat up this girl. I don't know what's happening. All right, Swampy and Scrapyard Recombiner. I have not seen much about this guy, but he is a construct. All right. Commons. Not bad. Not bad. We're on track, everybody. So far, not a total waste, but pretty good. We've probably made a little bit of our money back here. Not bad. That's, just, that's a cool piece. And Geomancer's Gambit, okay, foil, not bad, not bad. And the Endling, I don't know what the Endling is. Sounds like my child. All right, we got Urza's Rage. Okay, not bad, not bad. No shout out to Endling. Mm -hmm. All righty. What do we got? Starting off with a foil Rhino. Rhino. Million dollar cards, everybody. Don't forget that. Look at that. That's a cool piece. God. Looks like my boss. All right. Bam. All right. Well, we're racking up some foil commons. I don't really care much about that. And we have Altar of Dementia. Okay. It's a, if it's anything. Three dollar card. Yeah. Interesting. I like that sacrifice a creature target player puts number of cards equal to the sacrificed creature's power from the top of their library into their graveyard get out squirrel nest there you go chris you'll have somewhere to sleep now <laughs> speechless <laughs> speechless it's not usually how it goes everybody I, I wish you could i wish you could see the look i gave you. yes if looks could kill. If looks could kill. Good lord. He looked like Garouk. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Goblin. Some more beautiful oh, art. Amazing. Jesus, that guy's ugly. Looks like being going to wake up. Looks like Trevor from Grand Theft Auto. <laughs> <laughs> Bam. Force of negation. Oh, my God. Guys, this is a great box. Great box. Would have been better if this was a foil, but... I like that. That's a forty-seven dollar card. Yeah, force. I mean, that's, that's pretty solid. Force of negation. That's going up here with the mythics because I just, I just don't even know everybody. <laughs> I really don't. Um, just a little friendly factoid. I had purchased the core set twenty twenty over there, and I opened that. I got all three Chandras. I, I've just been winning the lottery all day today, which is why I felt compelled purchased the modern horizon or modern masters set over there look at that that's a sliver if i've ever seen one all right bam that's me that's me right now happy is all get out uh, that too cordial man. yeah i've never been known for my cordialness generous gift 
whatever. You guys don't care about this. We do, because after this, we're gonna probably review all these cards and then make another video showing you what cards are worth something for the game or money. Who knows? I will not commit to that though, so if you ask me about it, I will deny it. That's beautiful. All right, and we got another Hex Drinker regular. Get out! What is happening here? What is happening, guys? Come on. Come on. Um, is it possible? Is it possible? Red and six. That's next. Red God. Six. If, I get a, if I get a... Both in the same pouch. Oh. Those foil. That's what's going to happen right now. That would be a box error if I've ever seen one. I'll open this in front of you guys. Guys, this is just insane. Told you, late bloomer. It, it was a late bloomer, and you called that, buddy. We got the shapeshifter. You know what it is? It's because we're commenting on all these guys' amazing art. Steve Belladin? Jeez, man. Tone it down, buddy. You're a good artist. All right. Bam! Here we go. Prismatic Vista. Oh, my God. Everything else is just cherries on top, everybody. This is cherries on top. You cannot get better than my box right now. I've won the lottery. Of course it is. Of course it is. You, you can't beat this, guys. You can't. This is the late bloomer. And if I'm not mistaken, I believe we hit all the mythics we're probably going to hit. But who knows? Nah. I pulled a foil hex drinker and a hex drinker. This could be Urza right now. We don't know. We don't know. We pretend to know. That's a bizarre guy. Get it? Ren and fucking oh! six! Oh my god! Oh, what did I tell you? Guys! <coughs> oh my god! Breathe! This is just crazy! How Breathe. is this possible? How? How is this possible? <coughs> I would absolutely love to say I got this box from Level Up Gaming. It's over here in Duluth, Georgia. Greatest place ever. Shout out to Carter. That guy helped me out with this box. I saw a box on the shelf. He told me, no, don't buy that one. He opened a brand new case for me and let me pick my own box. What a guy, everybody. What a guy. This is exactly what I mean. You choose your own luck in this world. Ready? $92 card. That's all your money then, Sam. So. There you go. We got it, everybody. And, um, wow. That's all, that's all I have to say. I'm sorry, I'm not trying to neglect these cards, but geez, you can't beat that. You can't beat this opening right now. Plane Bound Accomplice, okay. And then we got some talismans. I won't bore you guys with those. All, all right. right. It's gonna be Urza. It's gonna all be right. Urza. Hey, if we're still rolling, if this is Urza, everybody, I will post a video of me doing something I don't know yet. Don't make promises. Well, I don't make promises. I would just, I would post a video of me crying, saying <laughs> leave Britney alone on YouTube <laughs> if I hit a Urza right now. And what do we got? Silent Clearing, I will take that. That, any any rare land card except for a few, except for a few, uh, they're usually- $15 cards? Yeah, they're usually worth quite a bit of money. Um, I understand why, but I also just, I don't play modern very much, so I don't know a whole lot. <clears throat> but I do know we are down to our last three packs. We are still looking for Urza. We got our main mission, which is getting a Ren and Six, but he still wasn't foil. We'll be looking for that guy soon. All right, some more beautiful art. Well done. And King of the Pride just totally trolled me. I don't like when they put those. And what do we got? Fiery Islet. So what I do know is that I'm going to use this card to build my first modern deck, the Mono red phoenix i'm gonna use that i'm gonna play at a local um 20 dollar card yeah i'm gonna i'm gonna play at my local card shop and modern try to win some more of this stuff who knows who knows fiery islet 20 bucks 20 bucks i will put the total value of this box at the bottom of the video when i upload it or i guess you're seeing it now so it's at the bottom everybody all right some more oh, nice that's art. awesome that's what my dreams look like, to be honest. 
Yeah, that's how I dream. Who did this one? Who did this? Jason Rainville? Dude, well done. Here we go. Here we go. On thin ice. My patients are on thin ice, let me tell you. I'll tell you, I am in a lot better mood after pulling the crap I just pulled, let me tell you. And um, I know I said we're on, this is our last pack, but really I got two more packs to bust. And hopefully you guys will see something cool. Who knows? All right, so we got the soldier. This is the last pack of Modern Horizons, everybody. Oh, uh, weird dude yeah, riding a easy. zebra. A zebra corn. Zebra corn. All right, man. Can of van. Jeez. Got the imagination I always wanted. And the plague engineer. Not sure about this guy. Looks crazy, though. Eight dollar car. Eight bucks, man. Well done. Well done, magic. Your cards, they feel great. That's the first thing I noticed about this set. They just feel thicker. They probably aren't thicker, but they just feel better. They feel like money. Yeah, they definitely feel like money. All right, everybody. So I'm gonna go with Domri, but I also have to try a Grizzle Blade. These are the ones we're going for, okay? We are hoping to hit the lottery. I do not know a lot of values in these cards. I do know that a lot of the rares are worth quite a bit of money. We're looking to just add a little bit on top. So let's see what we can get. I'm actually gonna start with Domri. All right, let's see. And I don't know the layout of this actually. I don't know if the rare is in the back. So we're gonna go through this together, I guess. This is my first time, so. Oh, I see a foil in the back, everybody. All right. These are nice. Should be an uncommon right now. Nope. Here we go. All right. Seaside Citadel. And I'm pretty sure you guys just saw that card. And if it's what I think it is, we did all right already. So, Seaside. That's dope. Something stinker. Vith Vithian? Vithian? God, he just looks insane. Look at that guy. God. All right, Putrefy. And we got Passed in Flames. Wonderful card. It's a mythic. Each instant sorcery card in your graveyard gains flashback until end of turn. The flashback cost is equal to its mana cost. Wonderful. All right, so I have no idea who this guy is. I just saw his name, I'm sure you all did too, and you're all probably screaming at your computers, either that I'm overhyping this card or it's completely worthless. But let's see. All right, it's an uncommon, okay? So don't know how much money there is in that. But it is a foil, Gruel War Chant. Attacking creatures you control get plus one, plus zero, and have menace. The usefulness of that card is amazing. And it's a red and green, so I'm sure somebody's using this somewhere. But Pass in Flames, Mythic number one. I like that. All right. Last pack for me, and then we'll give the rest to old C. That's Chris. Sorry. All right. Wonderful. Oh God, there's another foil back there, everybody. You know, I think there's actually a foil in every one. All right, put these down. Tattermunge, Racto Signet, Torrent of Souls, and Death Shadow. Check the value on that guy. Let's see, did I hit a lottery card? Who knows? Or actually, do you have access to that or is it something you're gonna search? Yeah, search. Search. Well, either way, I mean, not a bad, not a bad night, guys. Not a bad night. We, we hit some money. But anyway, that does it for this video. Stay tuned. We're gonna have another video of War of the Spark and two Modern Masters, 2017 edition and packs opening. So, thank you all for watching. Peace.